Good morning. Apologies, a bit of a delay in our presentation this week. Let's move forward. Yesterday, Saturday, there was a thunderstorm for eastern Otago. This is the map here. Uh, there was a front moving northwards over the South Island. In the east, it was more or less just a weak southerly change pushing through, but it did trigger storms uh, down there for uh, Dunedin, for example, uh, due to some coldish upper air. And I believe there were a few thunderstorms for the west coast too. Let's move forward. Uh, to Monday tomorrow morning where there's this low pressure system there moving onto the South Island quite broad in nature uh, not very low in terms of pressure but there you go it's uh, this front here the northwestern corner of the South Island there could be some instability there in the morning maybe a thunderstorm or two there is uh, quite a, sort of like a freshening southerly change here in the south and that's going to really push up the east coast of the south island during the day but from first thing in the morning there is actually like a southerly airflow there in the east and there's a slim chance sort of north of christchurch through to southern marlborough first thing in the morning there could be a thunderstorm triggered i don't think the risk is very high but there is a chance there. Let's move forward to, to a little bit later uh, on Monday. Uh, this map is for 7 p.m. in the evening. We can see a lot of rain moving into the east coast of the South Island there with that strengthening southerly airflow. The rain is welcome. It's been too damn hot lately. It's a bit like the rent is too damn high. It is uh, too damn dry. So there you go. Rain for the east, no thunderstorms though, but the air is uh, quite cold. So uh, there could be a little bit of snow in the ranges down to around about oh, 800 meters, 700 meters if you are lucky enough. The interesting uh, feature we shall talk about next is uh, as the southerly change, the like vigorous one, pushes into the lower North Island sort of late afternoon and then through into the evening, that uh, could trigger thunderstorms. And the risk is a little bit higher, especially sort of uh, here in the west, uh, southern Taranaki down through to Kapiti, and then up this eastern side, sort of late afternoon into the evening. I believe south of about Napier has the better chance. Then up here in the north, uh, north of Auckland, there could be a few convective clouds uh, into the afternoon, probably generated by like high uh, moisture, like a high dew point at the surface, I would say, and uh, converging winds that could lead to a few unstable showers, maybe some thunder up there. After these showers push northwards, we've got an anticyclone moving in from behind. And uh, that generates a frost, a frost risk for uh, first thing early on Tuesday about the interior of the South Island. We are getting into December now, <laughs> so frost risks are not going to be terribly high. But there is actually some chance there, quite cold in the morning uh, for the South Island. A wet day there in the east, dry out there in the west. Now after Tuesday next week, well to be honest, a lot of next week, the temperatures are going to be dialing down a notch uh, in the east, where I'm based, in Canterbury. It's been uh, pretty hot lately, as we just mentioned to, alluded to uh, a moment ago. Uh, so thankfully next week it's going to be a bit cooler. Uh, I am welcoming of that because I'm getting a bit sick of the heat to be honest. Next week a lot of the heat or the warmer weather shall we say is going to be more uh, up here in the north, uh, the western side of the country and central Otago at times. Eastern regions not as warm. So here is uh, the map for Wednesday. Basically there's a high pressure system there low pressure system there actually looks uh, quite vigorous quite deep but it is a way up there anyway uh, this is pushing sort of like an easterly quarter airflow into new zealand so hence yeah eastern regions are going to be cloudyish at times and uh, cooler while out west central otago and there in the north it is going to be warmer now let's move forward to Sunday 22nd of December, the 22nd of December. Low pressure system there moving in from the Tasman Sea. This is our next thunderstorm possibility. A bit of a wet weather moving into the west coast, the North Island. Uh, there is potential up here for some unstable activity. A few thunderstorms uh, perhaps in these shower clouds. But uh, yeah, it's uh, Sunday the 22nd of December. It's a wee while away. We'll just have to see how things unfold. Beyond that, believe it or not, the 23rd and perhaps even Christmas Day, I'm seeing instability in very long-range models. But uh, yeah, we'll talk about that uh, next Saturday morning. We'll catch you then. Cheers.